Hello, today we're gonna embark on a new Sims 4 challenge. And the challenge is no other than the Not So Berry Challenge, which was created by Lil Simsy in 2017. So it's not really a new challenge, but um, it's new to me, so... Okay. Now, this challenge involves having 10 generation of Sims, where each generation is represented by a color and their own unique set of rules and challenges. And I can only move on to the next generation when I've completed all the goals of the current generation. What will I get when I win this challenge, you may ask? Probably nothing, but um... Let's go. <laughs> We're starting off with the first generation, of course, which is the mint generation. And <laughs> for this challenge, I made my own little cards that I've spent way too much time on. You know, yeah, I didn't make the information on the cards. That was a little simsy, but I designed the cards if anyone's confused. I'm confused sometimes, mostly all the time. Okay, anyways, so the description of the Gen 1, the Mint, is You're a mischievous scientist that really loves to color mint. You're career-driven, but still make time for silly pranks and outings with your closest friends. You love luxury and want the best for yourself and your family. Ooh. <laughs> and the traits for the Mint generation is vegetarian, jealous, and materialistic. Yes. So the aspiration is chief of mischief and the career is scientist. And it's been a long time since I've played with the scientist career, so we shall see how that goes. And last but not least, the rules for the main generation is master the science career, complete the chief of mischief inspiration. That was a hard sentence to say. And master the mischief skills and master the logic skills and complete the elements collection. I feel like completing the elements collection is going to be a hard ask. This boy oh boy, I've, I don't think I think I've ever done that. Maybe I've done that, but I don't remember. All right, this is gonna be a fun challenge. <laughs> let's start. In side note, if you really enjoy the legacy challenge and you're like, Nora, what the heck is this? Or you're not going to continue with the legacy challenge. I am. I am going to continue with the legacy challenge. I just need a break from Lou. Okay. <laughs> I need to take a break from Lou right now, but I'm going to continue with the legacy challenge. So don't you worry. And of course, I'm going to continue with the building challenges. Of course, every Sunday. Watch out. Okay, we're in the create the sim in cast, as the cool kids call it. And um, let's start with the easy thing first. The name. I guess we got to call it Mint Cherry because otherwise it would just be wrong, right? I could just be all creative with it, but um, I think we will all get confused, even me. So let's just call it Mint Cherry. Mint Baby. Aspiration. What was it again? Teeth of Misty. It's all about the pranks and mayhem. I don't know what that accent was. Like the traits, it was vegetarian, materialistic, and jealous. Okay, let's see. I, I don't think I've ever had the jealous trait before. I just have to quickly check what it's all about. Can you be quiet for one second? I'm trying to read. Thank you. They gain a boost of confidence from being around their significant other. But they get tense if they haven't seen them recently. Okay, so the opposite of me. What am I talking about? I don't have a significant other. Okay, moving on from that. <laughs> Okay, now the cast stuff. I I gotta be honest, cast scares the living shit out of me. I don't think I know anything about anything anymore. But let's see. Two thousand years later. Right, it's been a while. I think I'm cutting all of that out because <laughs> I think I'm face blind or something. I don't know what faces look good or not. Like I don't I don't know how to make an attractive face. Like I I don't know. So <laughs> so I took a sim off of the gallery and I changed it just like a little bit. I wish I could have seen who made this, but I was such in a panic state that I, I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> but um, here we are. I haven't decided on anything yet except for, <laughs> for the face. <laughs> right. Moving on. The hair. I feel this hairstyle is a little bit like scientist-y. Hear me out. When you're doing science, it's good to not have super long messy hair so it will get in the science stuff. And she has two little braids to protect her hair from the science stuff. <laughs> that was my reasoning. <laughs> and by the freaking way, this color chooser thingy thingy, it doesn't work. I was like, okay, I want mint. So I picked blue and green because I was like, it's kind of in the middle of that. It didn't show me all the mint items that's in the game or even all of the blue and green stuff that's in the game. So 
that was useless. So I'm either going to go for that top. It has a little bit of mint or that top. But is that more like sea foam? We have this, <laughs> which is something of its own. I <laughs> And we have this, which is kind of okay -ish. Maybe that's more of a scientist vibe. I mean, why do I kind of like those pants though? Six and a half hours later. Okay, I think I'm done with the outfits. I had to stop somewhere or else I would be here all freaking day. So this is her everyday outfit. Good, good, good. Her formal. <laughs> her athletic. Athletic wear, her sleepwear, party wear, swimwear, hot weather wear, and cold weather wear. <laughs> I mean, I think it's beautiful. Let's move on. Mint berry. I'm gonna start with spring because I'm not a maniac. Ooh, where do we want to live? Because we can choose wherever we want to live. Hmm. I think I'm actually gonna go for Evergreen Harbor. Just hear me out. She's mint. I know she's not green, but mint reminds me of green. So get over it. And she's gonna be a scientist. And I feel like Evergreen Harbor is kind of science-y in my mind. So yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna choose this place. Now, which part? Um, I think maybe over here. Yeah. And I am going to bulldoze the lot. Goodbye. And here we are. Oh, wow. This place is looking rough. I forgot that <laughs> this is how the neighborhood is. Oof. All right. And you're tense. Why? Desperate for fun. From low fun. What the heck? We just started. You've just been born. And you have no fun and almost no social. What the heck? Okay. All right. Anyways, I am actually going to set my money to zero. I am actually gonna set my money to zero. And I know this isn't a part of the game, it isn't a part of the rules, but this is how I like to play my game. I like to start with zero money, because I, you know, because I like it that way. In my mind, I'm like, I was just born, I was just put on this place with no family, no money, 16 in the middle of Miami. And I'm just like, where did I get that 20,000 from? But that's just my two cents. You can play however you want to, but this is how I like to play. What do we got? We got a mailbox. I'm gonna move it. Over here. Bop. Nice. <laughs> Chief of mischief. Aspiration. What do we have to do? Okay. Perform 10 mean or mischievous interactions and be disliked by two sims. Ah, my favorite activities. Socializing with other sims. <laughs> it is kind of funny though, but uh, it's a hard aspiration. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Okay, the sim that I downloaded from um, the library already had skills and careers. Okay. Well, that's not good. I think I gotta change that. Hold on. Wait a second. Okay, I am now back. That took a long time, but I have now made her into a completely new sim. I, I washed her. <laughs> I washed her. I put her in the washing machine and here she is, a brand new sim. She don't know who she is. I completely erased her all mine. Good. Not to worry, it's now a brand new sim. All right, here we go. So I think the first order of business is to join the scientist career. Are you ready, Minty Mint? Yes, you are. Scientist. Yes, yeah, so we will earn 24 an hour, 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. And we have Sunday and Saturday off. Good. Oh, look at that. Okay, promotional tasks have two breakfast. How do we do that? Can happen at any time. For example, while gardening, reading, or performing experiments. Well, good. We don't have anything, so that's gonna be nice. <laughs> oh, who is this? Björn Bjergsen. All right. Good for you. I think we should go around and find some crystals and stuff because we do need to complete the elements collection. Are there any crystals around? No. Darn it. I don't really think this neighborhood has any crystals or metals. Oh, we have this one. Can we dig here? Come on, run! Mindy, run. Oh, I found a limestone. Oh, it's a fossil. Right, we can dig here. Dig, dig. Oh, it's a plant. A wild soy plant that has not been grown. Oh, wait, hold on. Hey, neighbor, do you want to learn how you can make a difference? If you've got a minute, I would love to chat with you about how your vote can help make this neighborhood more green. I mean, not really interested in that right now. I gotta be honest. I'm looking for rocks. And I found two common upgrade parts. And oh my gosh, Judith Ward, please stay home for once. I always end up meeting Judith Ward. She shows up frick frack everywhere. Okay, so I think a place that has a lot of crystals and metals and stuff is Willow Creek. So we're gonna go check around that place. Are we out? Oh, it's really dark here. Is there any crystals here? Any crystals at all? Doesn't really look like it. I see how it is. Well, maybe we can go fishing. Go fishing! Because if we go fishing, maybe it will pop up at some point. Oh, we got a tetra fish. Oh no, we have to go to the bathroom. She's gonna pee herself. This likes fishing. I mean... <laughs> 
Sure, you can have that one. Oh my god, Bjorn Bjergsen is here again? I think he's stalking me. Let's say a howdy introduction. And now he left. What is going on? Why did he leave? Come back! Howdy howdy. And now since you're here, Bjorn Bjorn, I gotta do some mischievous interactions. Let's do... Let's give fake bad news. And we can scare him. Lie back career. You know, the whole shebang. Okay, he left. He really did not like us. Has any crystal popped up? Oh, it has. Yes. Come, come. What do we get? We got another fossil. We can look for some frogs. Ooh, a striped eggplant frog. Oh, some more rocks. Dig, dig, dig. And this pile of whatever that is. Pile of dirt. Wait, I out to find some fossils. Ooh, okay. We got an Ozzynald and a robot salvage pot. Wow. Ooh. Another rock. Come, come. Another fossil. Right. Well, that was successful. Let's, um, let's go home. <laughs> okay, I think we can sell the frog. We can sell the tetra. And we can sell the fossils. And I can also sell that robot salvage part. Boop. Good. Can we send this little metal to the Geo Council? Yes, we can. Send to the Geo Council? Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's getting dark up in here. And we are also getting hungry. So let's go find a bar so we can eat. <laughs> the caboose. Sounds like a lovely bar. Oh, that, that's a really empty bar, I gotta say. But uh, anyways, can I please get some food? Oh, a bowl of olives. That sounds lovely. But you're uncomfortable because gross air. Right. Oh my god, me and her have the same outfit on. What the heck? Outfit stealer. Cannot believe this. Okay, let's talk to um Don Guzman. Fun introduction. And we can do a little mischief. Let's see. Let's trick with Hambaza. All right. I don't know if you like that or not. Let's do that spot. And we can scare. Oh my god, that celebrity. That's so annoying. We can also give some fake bad news. Oh my god, he looks so sad. I'm sorry. He really does not like us. But it's a part of the aspiration, so uh, it's all good. Woo! Now we just gotta be really disliked. So how do we get disliked? Give a mean gift? And yell at. Yell at him! Yell at Don! Oh, oh well. He really dislikes us. Wow. But we're still having a casual discussion, so I don't... You know, arguments. Argue... Oh, he left. Right. Let's get out of that bar and uh, let's uh, die for some deals. Because I can't take that celebrity one more second. Find a cabinet. Oh, wow. You're really uncomfortable now. Well, let's go home. He's so uncomfortable. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, home sweet home. We got a cabinet that's worth 200 simoleons. Oh, wow. I think we can afford a bed now, can we? Yes, we can. Woohoo. I'm gonna get this one. Like I always do. In that color. That has a little bit of mint in it, I feel like. Boop -boop -boop. Go to sleep. And sleep tight. Sleep tight, me child. When do we have work? In seven hours. Good. Okay, we really need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> this is not good. And we need to eat and we need some hygiene. You can take that little spot over there. Time capsule. Why are you going home? Return to lot. But why? There's nothing there. Okay, so I need to eat. I need to go to the bathroom and I need a shower. What's the best place for that? Maybe a gym. Who has a gym? Uh, Sam Machino has a gym. Oop. I better not see Judith Ward here. I'm gonna scream. Okay, you really need to be. Go to the bathroom. Come on, come on. What? Min should start thinking about further education. No, we're not gonna go to college. No, no, no. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, take a shower. Isn't it beautiful? Beautiful. Got all the amenities that you could ever want in here. We made a scientific breakthrough. Oh, that's good. We only need one more and then it's up for promotion. Is there any food here? No, not really. But this is San Maishuno, so... Could be a food stall here. Oh, we got one. Oh, we can add... Oh, that's expensive for a hot dog. Haggle. Come on. Oh, we are working like 10 minutes. Yeah, maybe we're not gonna eat that because... Um... Eliza, are you the vendor? Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for your new job. Wow. Go to work and uh, let's join. Our first day of work. I have a feeling it's gonna be horrible because we're hungry. But um, all right. Oh, look at you and your little cute outfit. Oh, that's right. We couldn't have eaten that hot dog because she's a vegetarian. I forgot. I knew this was gonna be difficult. Okay, what do we have? What, wah, 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 wah. what are our daily tasks? We have to ask a co-worker for metal. Okay. Experiment on the chemistry lab and invent a momentum conserver. Oh, a momentum conserver. 
<laughs> let's <laughs> Okay, we first have to introduce ourselves to the co-workers. I feel like that's important. Hello, hello. Marcus Flex. Oh, wow. You're a receptionist now. <laughs> they arise about aliens. Okay, we need to ask about a medal. How do we do that? Oh, maybe I can't get a medal from him because he's a receptionist. Maybe. Uh, I can ask Francine. Friendly introduction. Stop talking to Marcus. Did you say hi to... Say hi to Francine. Ah, that was a <laughs> weird introduction, but okay. Can I ask about getting a medal now where do i do that interest oh here it is ask for a medal it's in the interest section right we got a beckonite and i now have to chat with francine well that's good we're already doing that so no jokes on you <laughs> ask francine to pursue the dream job we gotta get her out of here we gotta get her out of here good get to know co-worker come on come on uh, where do i do that deep thought no small talk get to know oh she's a romantic oh uh, what are a plant? Let's do that. Oh, can we harvest these? Harvest all and then get away from there. I'm gonna harvest them all and then I'm gonna sell them <laughs> for some extra cash. Okay, let's water them. Um, Christopher Michelson. Wait, what? Hey, Mint. Been going through some stuff lately. Do you mind if I come over and stay for a while at your place? I just want to get away from things for a few days. Give myself time to process everything. I don't know who this man is. Who are you? I don't think I've ever seen him before. And I also don't really have a house or a place or anything. I just have a bed. But uh, yeah, sure. You can stay over. I'm confused. Right. Now we gotta ask a co-worker for a crystal. All right, all right, all right. We can ask for you. Relin Fonseca. That was a hard name to say. And I butchered it to heck it hell. Ask for crystal. Ooh, what do we got? Turquoise. Can I also ask for a medal from you? Ooh. Oh, I can ask for crystals from you too i'm gonna get all the crystals and metals up in here oh we got so many got a turquoise that's metal mm. peach and a fozonite mush okay what do we got to do now chat with the invention constructor for 10 minutes Right, okay. <laughs> this is a weird work task. I I can say that I've never done this at any work I've ever had. Let's... Oh, okay. Invent the momentum conserver. Can we just do that? Invent device momentum conserver. Right. We know absolutely nothing about science. And we can just invent something straight away. Right. And I don't think a lab technician does this on the daily. Just gotta be honest. If you're a lab technician, you do this on the daily? I just wanna know. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, the momentum conserver. What does it do? Turn on the momentum conserver. That's our next task. Turn on. Admire your new possession. What does it do? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna bring it home with me. Right. We have actually finished all the tasks we need to do today. Because we're already at goal level or the maximum level. So we don't need to do the other tasks. But what we can do is that we can eat a strawberry. One strawberry only. And then we can dig up some rocks for our rock collection dig 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 digging all around oh we got a, a treasure map let's dig it some more we're not really getting that many crystals and metals we're mostly getting the mysterious time capsules but anyways the work day is soon over yes i know hmm is there more crystals over here oh it is dig them all end of shift we made 281 simoleons oh la la oh who's this oh yeah that's christopher michelson the stay over guest <laughs> right we got mail oh we got element all right Right. so we got the ozonite good 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 so now we gotta send off all of these but i think some of them is ozonite so i'm gonna get a sample from all of them because i you know i want to keep some crystals and metals for myself no you know what that's taking too long time i am gonna send them all to the geo cancel send them all i'm gonna sell all of the capsules i know i can open them but some of them are worth less than the time capsule so i'm not gonna take that chance i'm also gonna sell all of this maybe i'll keep the strawberries and I'm gonna sell the robot salvage part. Oh my gosh, he took my bed? No, that's my bed. Assign bed to mint. Hold on, you can't take the only bed that's on this lot. <laughs> I don't even know you. All right, I got some money. Got some munti. So I can buy some stuff. What's most important? I think a toilet is really important. So I am gonna get a bush. Oop, because then we can pee in it. We can sleep in it. It's gonna be fine and dandy. Right, then we need a fridge. Oh, can get a little mint fridge. Ooh, that's nice. Put that there. Okay, so how much is the stand that you put the elements in? I have no idea what it's called. I don't know where it is, but I think it's somewhere. 85. Oh, that's super cheap. I'm gonna have that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it 
here beautiful oh it's so dark i'm gonna put me element in oh, look how beautiful best darling what do you want yeah i can't afford it whatever you're selling i can't afford it fine and i'm also gonna put my momentum conserver up because why not right now we have a fridge so we can eat a quick meal of ham and cheese sandwich oh you're going all the way over there oh no oh no don't eat that don't eat that we can't have a ham and cheese sandwich because we're vegetarian cereal yeah i'm sorry i forgot see michael you can have this one what was your name again christopher christopher you can uh, have this one that's for you All right go to the fertilize oh i just remember we already have a bed so we can't okay no worries we don't have to nap in that but you christopher you can you can nap in that if you want to i'm gonna go to sleep bye why am i sad i'm not sad anymore All right okay vlad is sending me a text hey there i just wanted to welcome you to the community and my that's a lovely neck you have there great love life is that christopher's suitcase can i pick up the suitcase <laughs> can i sell his suitcase oh no he's back All right let's not do that oh he's gone again okay what if oh he's back again let's pick up the suitcase can i just sell that oh no i can't all right or i can but it's worth no money open the suitcase i want to see what i got Ooh, that's beautiful that's good for you christopher that you got your own suitcase let's go back to sleep it's morning time let's have some more cereal this time <laughs> Right, I think I'm gonna end it there. <laughs> I mean, it was a really good first day. It was beautiful, it was magnificent. And we also got like a lot done. We got the scientist career, we got, got one of the mischiefs task done. I mean, it was a wonderful day. <laughs> Anyways, don't forget to like and subscribe because it really does help me out. Oh, well, thank you. But only if you want to, only if you want to. And uh, I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.